one of the key areas that sometimes we carry tension is in our shoulders and our neck. And we can really feel like the muscles are gripping towards the bones. The shoulders feel really restricted and they ache and it feels just like you're carrying the weight of the world on your shoulders. Moving, stretching, mobilising your shoulders will really, really help. So if we keep moving the body, we often find that if we've got tension in the mind or we're feeling as if we're emotionally carrying the weight of the world on our shoulders, that movement can help to release that. So I'd like to just guide you through a very gentle movement practice that's very much focused on the shoulders, the arms, and it will also help into the neck. So find a comfortable standing position, recommending that you take your feet at a hip width distance, remembering that you can check that by taking one heel across towards the medial arch of the opposite foot, and then where your toes finish, you want to just draw your foot then to face forwards. So the heels are up against an imaginary wall, so that your back of your feet are level, and then your feet are both facing forwards. So that keeps the hips facing forward and the shoulders facing forwards. So then just find a nice standing position. Don't lock out the knees, but keep the legs really strong. Hips are in a nice neutral alignment, so we're not tipping into one side or tipping into the other. And sometimes just placing a mirror in front of you will allow you to see how you stand. And then you can make those very, very gentle, subtle um, movements to realign the spine. So shoulders relax, arms just resting down to your side. And then turn your palms to face forward and just move the hands slightly away from your body. But don't take your arms back. So notice here when I take my arms back, then I'm really starting to pull into my shoulders. So I just want them to be relaxed into the outer edge of the um, or to the outer edge of my hips and within the periphery vision of my eye gaze. So with my eye gaze forward, I can see out the corner of my eyes, I can just see the trace of my hands. So I'm going to rotate the arms round and I can turn the palms up towards the ceiling. I can really feel this across the shoulder blades. And then I'm going to turn the arms back so that we're moving in the opposite direction, palms facing uppermost. So rotating the arms round, and this movement is initiated from the shoulders, down the arms, into the fingers, and then again from the shoulders, I can feel it moving outwards through the arms, the elbows, into the fingers. And then just keep moving in this way. We're going to start to lift the arms up on each movement so that the hands come to about a shoulder height. Now, if you've got any blood pressure problems, you might want to, not want to take your hands up this high, so just keep them a little bit lower. Alter and listen to your body if this doesn't feel good for you. So we keep the palms uppermost now, lift up the chest, drop through the shoulders, still thinking about pushing down to the soles of feet, and my crown is lifting up towards the ceiling, but I'm not taking my chin up, chin is parallel to the floor. I'm gonna to look towards the open right palm and turn the left palm round in itself. So now it feels like I'm ringing out right across the shoulders, into the arms, into the fingers, and then I'm gonna to open towards the left, I'm gonna to look towards the left palm and rotate the left arm round on itself. So looking towards the open palm, and then rotate the opposite arm round. Gentle with the neck movements, and again, making sure that I'm not locking out my knee joints. And it feels like all the tension in my shoulders, in my arms, in my neck is just being released. And then just start to slowly float the arms down, keeping that movement going. Making sure that you breathe, so don't hold your breath. I quite like to breathe into one side and breathe out to the other side. And then once the hands come back down towards the hips, just relax your arms. And again, I love this pausing, this stopping, and just noticing how different it feels. And it might not be that you feel any different. The more that you do this, the more that you will feel it will release or notice that it will release tension and tightness out of your shoulders. But just for a moment, just pause. And you might feel a tingling sensation through the palms of the hands. That's the energy that we've moved right down into the fingers. So that's a good feeling, good sensation. Or you might feel that your hands, your arms are a little heavier. So for me, I can feel that drop of the shoulders down away from the ears. My arms feel a little longer. But you just notice as you close your eyes and just stand here, just 
just notice any changes, any effect, good, bad, or none at all.